I'm uh, sorry. Uh, I made a slight mistake. Uh, it will become sixty-five and thirty-five by sixty-five, which is the mole fraction of O two into the total pressure, which is one into ten to the power of five. So this is the uh, partial pressures of uh, Cl two and O two. So when I have to calculate the K value of Kp, Kp is equal to thirty by th uh, it will be thirty five by sixty five because it was P O two. I'm sorry. This is P O two over thirty by sixty five. First, I open the bracket. Thirty by sixty five into one into ten to the power of five, which is P C L two whole square. Because as I have my K P expression over here, it says it has to be like this. So this will be as I use my calculator. This turns out to be two point five three. Into ten to the power of minus five. So this is the value of my Kp, and it says that calculate Kp and state its units. So I've calculated the value of Kp. Now the units. So for the numerator, the units are pascals because the partial pressure is in pascals. In the denominator, it is pascal square because it is the square of the partial pressure. So P A over P A square will give me P A to the power of minus one, which is or or per pascal, which is same as P A to the power of minus one. So P A to the power of minus one will be my unit, and two point five three into ten to the power of minus five will be my value of K P, and that's how we calculate K P. So let's move to the next example. Okay, so hydrogen chloride undergoes a reversible reaction with oxygen. Four uh, HCl gas plus O2 gas gives two Cl2 gas plus two H2O gas. Okay, so all gases in this reaction, when 1.6 mole of HCl are mixed in a sealed container with 0.5 mole of O2 at 400 degrees Celsius, 0.6 mole of Cl2. And 0.6 mole of H2O are formed. So this is the amount in in the equilibrium mixture, and the total pressure inside the container is 1.5 into 10 to the power of 5 pascals. Okay. So now first I will write my equation again over here. So it becomes 4 HCl. Just a second. There is some problem with my mouse. So yeah. Okay. So I will write it again. It becomes four H C L gas plus O two gas gives me in a reversible reaction two C L two gas. Plus two H two O gas. Now I write I for initial. I'm sorry. I write I for initial and F for final. So initial and final. Now. I uh, have initially I have one point six moles of HCl, one point six zero, and I have zero point five mole of O two, and because I have not reacted it yet, because this is the initial amount, I have zero moles of this initially, and then uh, wait, let me write it to three significant figures. Yeah, so I have zero of these two, and I have one point six of HCl and zero point five of O two, and final I have. 
0.6 mole of Cl2 and I have 0.6 mole of H2O.